stocks and crypto enjoyed a rebound this week. Is this it for the dip? Should we start buying or is it a fake out? I'm going to analyze the S&P 500 first and then Bitcoin for a general market movement. Well, am I to analyze this stuff? My name is Kiana Daniel and I started my investing journey back in the 2008 market crash. This is just one of my stock portfolios today. I'm also a mom to this little cutie. I love you. I love you too. S&P 500 first. Looking at the monthly chart, we noticed that the price has dropped to exactly 23% Fibonacci retracement level. And that's where we're seeing the rebound. Also added the Ichimoku cloud to my chart. And we also know that the 23% Fibonacci retracement level is typically the weakest one. While the 38% and 50% Fibonacci retracement levels are typically stronger. The Ichimoku cloud is also acting as a support and the price has a very long way to go before it reaches it. With that, it looks like the July rebound may be a temporary fake out. Bitcoin is a different story. It's been in the process of a very long double top bearish reversal chart pattern. The biggest characteristic of a double top chart pattern is that after it's confirmed below the neckline, the price typically drops the same amount from the neckline to the top. So once you measure that, that means that Bitcoin price could drop to here, which is around $11,000, which is also the price I've been calling out for the Bitcoin bottom for a few months. It also falls on the upper band of the current Ichimoku cloud, with the future cloud being way above here and bullish. Now, I'm clearly not Nostradamus, and that's why I've been setting buy limit orders at these key psychological levels. Are you going to wait for more drops or are you going to buy now? Let me know in the comments and follow for more money tips.